Okay. You ready? Yeah, let's do this. Method Factory, as you know, is an application development firm. Um, we're very technically oriented, um, but our focus is and needs to be on software development, um, engineering uh, and implementation of e-commerce and portal solutions, primarily. Uh, accidentally um, uh, bumped into Chad at the gym. I've known Steve Walter for years and, and ran into the gym, ran into him at the gym, you know, every morning for you know a year or two. And he was there one morning and had a question about a, an issue that they were having on their Exchange server. And I said, you know, why don't you have us come in and sit down and talk to you? So that was back in 2010. We had um, a challenge in that we, although we're very technically capable, um, we had our internal people spending too much of their time um, uh, dealing with our IT issues. As you know, we're a software development company, um, so we do have expertise in-house, um, but what was happening was that the time that our people were having to spend on maintaining our technology infrastructure was time that they were not available to really perform their core jobs and that was that was really the genesis of, uh, of me reaching out to Chad to determine whether or not they could be of service to us. The um, growth that they were experiencing was just starting to really overwhelm the resources that they had internally so you know it was a perfect fit for them to reach out to a company like South Tech who had an entire team that could manage their network and support them and, and kind of as they grow. But when we started off it was just a redesign and a rebuild of their hosted data center um, so we went through that entire project and they were very happy with what we had done for them so the next thing we did is started managing and monitoring all the resources up there um, at their data center. That then progressed into a complete rebuild of their Sarasota network um, and their internal resources with a highly available um, network there and then that dovetailed into us managing and monitoring that network as well. We tried doing some uh, monitoring and management using national firms, um, IBM, Dell, uh, some of those organizations, and they just did not have the same commitment to, to our objectives. They pick up the phone nights and weekends. Previously, Method Factory only had two internal IT resources to depend on. Now they have the entire South Tech team. So if there's an alarm that goes off at 3 o'clock in the morning at the data center, their team doesn't have to respond to it, South Tech does. It's the personal touch probably that really distinguishes them from the other alternatives we've uh, investigated. So last question here, but what, what's your favorite thing about working with South Tech? I think it's probably Chad's stunning good looks. <laughs> what? What? So just have fun with it. Don't, okay. Don't be afraid to smile. I don't think you smiled once the entire time. No. No, I don't smile a lot. <laughs> okay. Okay. So why did you choose South Tech? They were the least horrible of the options that we had available. Excellent. Excellent. Yeah. Nothing to do with the interlude at the gym. No. <laughs> and that was on the floor. That was not in the locker room. <laughs> okay. Let's back that up again. And the second time you said pager. Is the reason why you're saying pager? No. I don't know. No, it's a figure speech. Pager. You know what a pager is. They're like up from the 80s, right? Yeah. Just check. Pager. Yeah, edit that out. <laughs> Keep it down! <laughs> you're breaking my train of thought here. <laughs> personal touch. Done. Per personal. Personal touch. That's a wrap. Fantastic. <laughs>